morning babies it's been a minute i look really gross but that is going to change i had just got back from a little over a week long trip last night from visiting my family there's some stuff going on and this month is going to be really hard for me and that's not something that i really realized until a couple days ago so i'm going to try my best to be consistent with videos and get content out also to just keep my mind off things and keep myself in a positive headspace. I have a couple things on my to-do list today but I'm just gonna slowly ease back into stuff because I don't want to overwhelm myself. Or a couple things I'm gonna do. First things first is I'm gonna shower and get all clean and I'm gonna shave this because this is gross. And then after that I am probably gonna get dressed I don't know if I want to get dressed in baby clothes or not today. I might just wear shorts and a cute t-shirt. That way I can move around all good. And then I can change into a onesie and stuff later if I want to. I also want to give you guys a couple little hauls today. I got a couple things from AliExpress. A new passy from Small Ones. And I went to Dollar Tree while I was gone and I want to show you what I got. So I'm going to shower and do a quick little tidy in here because there's just a couple things on the floor, some trash that needs to be thrown away. It'll only take a few minutes and I'm going to do the same in the regression room and probably unpack. I didn't bring much stuff with me this time out there so I don't have a lot to unpack. But I also got to refill my meds and I was gonna go pick up my anxiety meds today because I really really need them and I'm a little bit frustrated. But that's life right now. So I'm going to do that. And I have to transfer all of my old files over to a new hard drive. Because my old hard drive completely failed on me. Which is not fun. But again, that's something that should only take a few minutes. So that's the plan for today. I just want to hang out with you guys and slowly ease back into things. I might film another regression video today. It probably won't be a super interactive one. Maybe just like finishing sticker bombing or I don't know what else we will see but I'm gonna go hop in the shower and be all clean all right friends we are showered and shaved I feel a lot better now that my hair is done and this is done I am keeping this so because it does give me just a little bit of gender euphoria so I probably won't keep it for more than a few days but I wanted to see what it would look like if I didn't shave it all off. So I don't think it looks horrible, but I definitely don't think it looks good. <laughs> so now it is tidying time. So I am going to skedaddle over into the regression room and work on there first because there's only a couple of things that I have to pick up in there. And then it'll be time for the 10 minute tidy out here. And we are done. Tidying was good, only took like 15 minutes, which is exciting and good. Now I've got a tidy space, but I wanted to show you a couple of things that I got in the mail. Not the Dollar Tree stuff just yet. I still have to go grab that out of my car, but I got some new passy clips. Let me lay these down so I can show you properly. These are what the passy clips look like. I got a red one with white spots a blue one with white stars, and this one with some roses on it. I thought it was really cute. And I got these off AliExpress. I think they were around $1.20 each, and that's including shipping. And they're adjustable in adult size, so yay. And I also got this stuff from Small Ones. All of these were extras, and then this is such a pretty passy clip. I love it. I love it. And then the big kahuna. This passy. It's so cute and sparkly and it's Winnie the Pooh. And I actually have a somewhat new Winnie the Pooh passy 
Passy clip. So now I have a Passy to match it and I'm super excited. I don't have a Winnie the Pooh Passy yet and I don't know that I have a Deco Red Passy yet. So this is exciting. I love it so much. It's literally the cutest freaking thing ever. I will leave a link to the shop down in the description. It's small ones on Instagram, small spelled S-M-O-L. Really good, and it feels super duper high quality and stuff too. It's super pretty, I love it. And this is my first one that has little itty bitty flowers. I love those little flowers. So the tidying is done. I think now I'm gonna work on transferring all of my files over to my new hard drive because I gotta get those on there as soon as possible. But then after that, I'm gonna read a little bit and plan a video. I did want to show you guys the stuff that I got from Dollar Tree that I said I was gonna show you. First things first, I saw someone on Adri Instagram and they were finger painting and I was like, I want to finger paint, but I didn't have any finger painting stuff. So I looked at the Dollar Tree out where I grew up when I was visiting family and they had stuff. So I just got a big old bag of all the colors of temper paint they had. They didn't have big yellow ones, so I got a couple small Crayola yellow ones, but the rest are just big old tempera. Now we can look into the other bag. I got quite a few craft things. I also got a small one of these. I have a big one that I use to hold up my iPad when I'm FaceTiming people, but I wanted a small one for my phone. I got this little DIY chalkboard that I'm gonna put on the regression room door and I'm also gonna put this little arrow sign on the regression room door after I paint it. I got a chalkboard marker to go with the chalkboard. This little itty bitty box that has a house. I'm gonna use it as a little bitty passy box, I think. Some gold pony bees for bracelet making. The more tacky glue because you always need some tacky glue and I really like tacky glue, so. Then I got another little tray, kinda like the one I already have that has stars in the sides, but this one's got hearts and I thought that was pretty cute. I got some more of these little blocks, wooden blocks, because I have a couple craft ideas for these and I needed some more of them. And then for the walls in the regression room, I got this little mirror. Look, you can see yourselves. <laughs> But it's super cute. It's the moon and stars and it's good. Lots and lots of good stuff. It's not very nice out today. It's cloudy. But I don't think it's going to be rainy, which really sucks. Because if it's going to be cloudy, it might as well be rainy. But I think I might try to film another AG video today. I'm not sure what I'm going to film. I have yet to decide, but I know I really do today need to make sure that I'm doing some self-care because I have been severely lacking in that department lately, and that's really not good for you. And because the last couple of days were rough, I do have some tidying up out here I gotta do. So I think I'm gonna turn on one of my favorite YouTubers, Allison. That's just her channel name, Allison. Very nice. She's super cute and does a lot of, like, good self-development and lifestyle stuff and that's some of my favorite kind of content so i think i'm gonna turn her shop with me for fall video on because it was uploaded a couple days ago and i still haven't seen it so i think i'm gonna turn that on and while that's on i am gonna clean up and then if before it's over i'm finished cleaning up i'm gonna come up with a self-care game plan for today i think I also think I'm probably not going to be super on social media today. I just don't really, I don't know. I like Instagram, I like Twitter, and I might be on a little bit, but I don't want to spend a lot of my day on today. Some days I do, and that's okay, but today is not that day. Alright, let's get tidying. So I started cleaning up out here a little bit, and I also have my lunchies cooking. I finally got my little toaster oven, which is going to be super nice helping me with portion control with my issues. So very excited about that. So I just have a little pot pie cooking 
right now. I love those little pot pies. The banquet ones are like a dollar. But I made my bed and it looks so good. It's like a real good mix of baby me and adult me, which I love. Because I do regress often when I'm getting ready for bed and like about to fall asleep. So I do like to keep some regression things out here like my teether, some stuffies, my blocks. But I think it looks cute. And then obviously my pillows. I love that subscribe pillow is like the best investment I've ever made. I love it. I also have one somewhere that is light blue and says light. Have not been able to locate it yet since I moved out here, which has been a couple years. So not sure where it's at. But those ones are here. Yay. And I still got a few things to clean up on this table. I cleaned up that table as much as I could. And I worked on picking up the floor. So obviously I, still, I did get a few things done. I also want to show you guys a little bit in the regression room. Because I'm working on it. There's still quite a bit that needs to be done. But I love it. So this is what we've got. First of all, I've got a giant thing of toys. And then more diapers that don't have anywhere else to go right now. <laughs> come over here and I got my little shelves. I'm gonna sticker bomb this shelf. I actually got this shelf with the stickers already on it from a thrift store but I was like you know what it's already started might as well. These two are from Michaels and obviously my stuff and I think that one I got on Amazon like several several years ago. I like these ones better. My little tent with all my stuffies and I still got work to do over here. So that one's pretty much done. That one's pretty much done. These two are pretty much done. This one, the whole bottom ones I need to reorganize. And I need to bring in movies and books and all that stuff and more toys. And I totally have to arrange up there. I haven't touched up there since the start of this room. There's also just a lot of like vinyl stickers up here because I was deciding about what to put on here. And I will be doing another video soon sticker bombing the rest of this shelf which I am very, very excited about. It's gonna look so good. It already looks so good. And then of course, the little ball pits that I do need to get more balls for. Oh, there's a hanger in there. Good to know. I do need to get more ball pit balls. And there's also a My Little Pony bowling set in here. <laughs> I don't know if you can see that. But then the closet, the baby closet, with all of the baby clothes. So that's what it's looking like right now. It's pretty exciting. I still have quite a bit of toys and stuff that are in that back closet because I just don't think there's enough room for them. And they're also not ones that I use like all the time. So it's not going to be that much of a hassle to get them out when I want to use them. But I'm super duper excited. I am liking the way it's coming slowly but surely. Super pumped. Do have to get a new VHS player though. Two new ones because I need one for in there. But also my other one that I have out here, my VHS and DVD player, broke. One of my favorite VHS's in it. And I'm so upset because it was one from my childhood and I know I'm not going to be able to find it again. <laughs> So we gotta see if we can get that fixed. But I think I might do a little bit of work in some of the cubbies in the regression room today after I get this table all tidy and maybe take care of those two things. We'll see, we'll find out. All right, friends, I think I'm gonna turn in for the evening. It's not late, it's actually just the afternoon, but I kinda wanna spend the rest of the day just focusing on myself, taking care of myself. I know today's vlog wasn't super Adri-centric, but I hope that's okay. I really love sharing my vlogs with you. The next Adri vlog will definitely be more Adri-centric, though. I also filmed another video for the Adri channel that will be coming out after this one so you want to subscribe to stay tuned for that because it's a good one if you want to keep up with me at day to day in between uploads you can follow me over on instagram which is at crayons and pencils or over on twitter which is at crayon kiddo I also have a Ko-Fi linked down in the description where you can send me a tip for just the price of the coffee. If you really enjoy my content, that is an awesome way to show it and it really helps me out. But there's also a wish list down there if you'd rather spoil a baby. I love you guys so very much and I will see you soon. Goodbye!